What's going on guys? Loaf Meat here playing more Fallout 4. Today I'm actually going to be showing you a quick little duplication glitch that um, still as of patch 1.02 still works. Um, th there was a lot of uh, ambiguity whether or not uh, this, this uh, exploit still works, but it, it does. I can confirm and I'll show you guys how to do it and what you need in order to do it uh, and I'm also going to explain the easiest way to use this exploit to um, level up. You can actually uh, use this to help you get more levels than you could ever do out in the wasteland. So first things first, uh, the way that this duplication works is that you can only duplicate shipments with this. I'll show you what I have in my inventory right here come over to junk and I have three shipments of copper as you know each each shipment counts for 25 copper and that's what that number means and then next to that is the three in brackets that three just means I have three of the shipments now when I do this um, or if you want to do this duplication glitch at home you're gonna need you're gonna you're gonna want I should say um, multiple shipments. Uh, the recommended number is five, uh, all of the same shipment. So if you wanted to duplicate aluminum uh, by, you know, up to five shipments of aluminum, and then th the glitch will work way easier that way. But the reason why you need multiples and why it's easier with multiples, and I'll show you uh, in a bit, it's because the game uh, whenever I'll open up uh, this and show you. So I have 5,852 copper. I have already started using this glitch and that's like, this is me confirming that it still works as of patch 1.02. Um, whenever you, uh, in the screen, if I were to hit triangle, since I'm playing on PS4, it would be Y if you're on Xbox One. I don't know what it is on PC, sorry. Um, to store all, store all junk. If I do that, it puts my shipments into the workstation. And the workstation actually takes about half a second to register each shipment as a complete... Like, it, it takes about half a second to register them all as shipments. So you actually have to do this very quickly. And the way you do it is, for me, you would press triangle and immediately press square to take all and I'll show you it's hard to see what happened there but I, when I put my shipments in um, the workstation started counting up uh, counting uh, uh, three shipments of 25 75 it started counting up 75 copper but before it reached or before it could count up that high um, I took all of my uh, items out of the workbench, including my shipments. So what happened was, is I actually got the 75 copper, but because it didn't register that that copper was coming from my shipments, I get my shipments back. And the reason why it's easier to do with multiple shipments is that multiple shipments take longer to calculate. So three shipments takes longer to calculate than two, two shipments take longer to calculate than one. And that's how that works. So it becomes easier with the more shipments that you have. So I'll bring up my inventory and I'll show you. I still have my three shipments of copper, but I have 5,902 uh, copper pieces separately. And I'll do this a few more times. So I want to open this up. Yeah, take note of how fast I'm going. Uh, the fastest way to do it, I'm actually using the thumbs of both my hands. So as soon as I press down the triangle with one thumb, I'm pressing square with the other. But it is also recommended that you just pretty much slide your thumb from one button to the other. It has to be a very quick succession. And I'll do it a few more times. I'll at least get... Uh, we'll say 
7,000. Okay, that's good. That's good enough. So now that I have 7,000 copper, I'm going to put them all back into my uh, workstation here. Oh yeah, I'm in ammo. There we go. Now you don't want to put your shipment to the copper, and you do want to you you want to save your shipments because as soon as you put them in there, if you let them set for more than half a second, um, they'll just become copper, and you won't be able to get your shipments back. So don't store all; you still want to keep a hold of them. Now, this is an experience exploit I'm going to show you next. I have an ass ton of copper, so what I'm going to do with that copper is I'm going to open up this. Scroll over to decorations, and I can make statues. Now, you can't make copper statues until you find the, um, what is it, Home Living magazine. You have to find a magazine that will allow you to do the, uh, the, the statues. So, I will show you exactly where you can get them. The magazine in order to do that statue is way over here. Uh, I think it's a little south. Uh, ironwork something or other. Oh, there it is. Okay, you have to go to Sagas Ironworks, and you have to go. You have to go through the entire dungeon and make it into what I believe is the boiler room. Uh, there's a small mini quest tied to that. Whenever you walk in, you'll have to fight a unique raider who's trying to take over a nearby farm. This one, um, kill him, and rate. Right next to where uh, that raider is standing on the ground is the magazine that you need for to get to do the statues. So, I hope you guys uh, can figure that out. Um, I won't be showing you exactly where it is. Just go to uh, Sagas Ironworks to find that magazine. Alright, now back to some statue making. So, here we go. You want to either do this first or second statue. It honestly doesn't matter because, as you can see, each statue here just uh, takes 10 copper. Uh, doing anything else takes more copper, so you're going to get, you know, you're not going to get as much as a return. So let's start making statues. Just walk backwards in a straight line because it will be easier to clean up after yourself when you're done. You can just go through and... Uh, scrap everything. Okay, I ran, uh, tripped over this log. So that's a sign for me to start going back the other way. So let's do this. Of course, I have the idiot savant uh, perk, so of course, you know, every so often I'm gonna get an ass ton more experience than I really should be getting. You can mix it up, you can serpentine a little bit, do a little bit of spider circles. I'll make a cock and balls there. So if I were to zoom out, I pretty much just made a cock and balls here. <laughs> but anyway, like as you can see, uh, by using this glitch or using this exploit, I have managed to go up two levels in just what five minutes, and I even spent a lot of time explaining this stuff to you. So if you want to try this out for yourself. You can go from level 10 to level 50 in less than a half hour. If this is uh, if this is something that you want to do, go ahead, do it. Um, you know, my excuse is I've beaten the game legitimately. I went through it once, and now that I'm on a, a character build that I'm just out there having fun with, nah, eh, fuck it. You know, I will see whatever I can do. So um, this has been Loaf Meat uh, confirming that. The shipment duplication glitch on the PS4 still works after patch 1.02. If you guys like it, give me a like, subscribe, do whatever you do to show your support, and I'll see you guys in the future. Bye!